And we have several survivors of your wedding reception, uh, an <laughs> epic of its kind, here this evening. Uh, your best man was drummer Tony Fernandez. Tony, I'm sure you have plenty of material for your speech. The wedding was quite spectacular. There's one spectacular event of Rick's, which I remember went badly wrong. We were doing a show in Seattle, and he decided to make use of this Wurlitzer organ that rose out from the front of the stage. It hadn't been used in years. He disappeared under the stage. The thing started to rise up, and the crowd were all cheering his head. Just got just above the stage, and then the whole thing just absolutely collapsed. He came off stage at the end. He sacked the band. Then he actually sacked himself and reinstated the band. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, the church where you married urgently needed a new organ. Uh, to raise money, you write your musical version of the Gospels and you stage its premiere in the church. Ramon Remedios, you sang at that first performance. Yes, I did. Um, he actually wrote four pieces of uh, the Gospels and they were absolutely wonderful. So I got on to him and I said, you really have to make this into a bigger, bigger piece. And in fact, he wrote the Gospels and it's a really a modern oratorial. And I was very proud of him to ask me to sing it, and I'm proud to be his friend. Thank you. Writing your version of the Gospels rekindled your faith, and once again you become a regular churchgoer. You turn over another new leaf and give up alcohol. Your son Oscar is born in Guildford in May 1986. Two years later, the family moves to the Isle of Man. Hey, I tell you what, Rick, if you thought you're in for a bit of peace and quiet here, oh, you, you made a big mistake, I'm telling you that. It's yes, your friend and neighbour, Norman Wisdom. So, Norman, you've been workmates and you've been playmates. Oh, playmates, yes. Yeah. I play clarinet, he plays piano. <laughs> <laughs> no, well, we've had some wonderful laughs yeah. together, haven't we? A right. few laughs, especially in your studio. Oh, yeah. Hello, man. Hey, do you remember we were doing the recording of the musical World of Wisdom? Yeah. You know, which I'd, I'd written the, the lyrics and the music, and you'd done the wonderful orchestrations, and, and you were sitting in the recording gallery. Yep. And, and, I'll be, and then we'll be recording the song, and I was standing by the microphone, see, and you were looking at me, and I was, I was singing the song like that. <laughs> <laughs> and you came busting out, and you said, you come and you, move, you said the microphone's not working, and you moved it over, remember? Yeah. <laughs> and you put another microphone there, and went back into the recording gallery, and I started again. And, but, and, and then you heard that the microphone was working really because I started to go. <laughs> <laughs> you came out, I thought you were going to splash me in the gob, but you came out. <laughs> you know, uh, anyway, I'll see you can it and go to the film. Now, professionally, you remain very busy, touring again with Yes, writing movie soundtracks and recording an album with your son, Adam. What's it like to work with your dad, Adam? Awful. Dreadful. <laughs> no, it's great. He's very laid back, and we've done over 400 shows together now. And uh, I think he's really getting the hang of it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and since childhood, you've been a supporter of Brentford Football Club. Oliver, has he instilled that love in you as well? Uh, yeah, he used to drag us down to Camberley Town Football Club. He used to give us jobs to do. He used to say, go to the gate and charge everyone to get in. And so we did. We charged the ref, the linesman, <laughs> all the other teams, and then he stopped taking us. Yeah. <laughs> Oddly enough. <laughs> well, the success story continues. You've made your mark on television as compare for the stand-up comedy show, Live at Jongleurs. At uh, this moment, an old friend of yours, one of comedy's finest, is giving his Kafka's dick at the Piccadilly Theatre. But he sends you this message, Eric Sykes. Hello, Rick and Nina. And I'm sorry I can't be with you tonight, but as you can see, I'm in my dressing room. I'm telling you that, then you won't think I'm in an old people's home. <laughs> Incidentally, this is my first costume, so you know we're not doing the importance of being earnest again. But look at it, I was measured for this. And it's got RW at the back, so I've got a feeling, Rick, that this is one of the cardigans that you took and gave to Oxfam. Well, anyway, I really do miss not being there tonight. And I thank you for all the pleasure on the piano that listening to you. And for your humility, but above all, for your friendship, Rick. Have a lovely time.
You're now working on your most ambitious project ever, a new symphonic opus, Return to the Center of the Earth. Now, three months ago, you were in Los Angeles working around the clock in recording studios. By the time you got back to England, you were seriously ill. You were taken into intensive care with a life-threatening combination of pneumonia and pleurisy. It meant you had to pull out of a favorite charity event, a golf classic named after one of the world's finest entertainers. Where, oh, where is Rick Wadman? Where, oh, where is he? I need him to fill out a person. Where, oh, where is he? How are you? So how are you? You flew club class, obviously. Yes, sir. <laughs> But we missed you this, this year, you know. And one of the, the greatest performances I have ever seen in that tournament, which has been going on for 12 years, uh, he and his son sat opposite each other on two keyboards. And the performance that they gave that night was one of the most exciting things I've ever seen in my whole life. To see a great artist like Rick is, to sit down with his son and see the competition and the love between them was just remarkable. And the whole audience, it just wiped us out. And if you don't come back and do it again, I'm going to come down and give you pneumonia. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Thank 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 you.